What is the most astounding fact you can share with us about the universe? The most astounding fact is the knowledge that the atoms that comprise life on Earth, the atoms that make up the human body, are traceable to the crucibles that cooked light elements into heavy elements in their core under extreme temperatures and pressure. So these stars, the high mass ones among them, went unstable in their later years. They collapsed and then exploded, scattering their enriched guts across the galaxy. Guts made of carbon, nitrogen, oxygen, and all the fundamental ingredients of life itself. These ingredients become part of gas clouds that condense, collapse, form the next generation of solar systems, stars with orbiting planets. And those planets now have the ingredients for life itself. So that when I look up at the night sky, and I know that, yes, we are part of this universe, we are in this universe, but perhaps more important than both of those facts is that the universe is in us. When I reflect on that fact, I look up. Many people feel small because they're small and the universe is big, but I feel big because my atoms from those stars. If you expected science to give all the answers to questions about what we are, where we're going, what the meaning of the universe is, and so on, then I think you could easily become disillusioned and then look for some mystic answer to these problems. How a scientist can take a mystic answer, I don't know, because the whole spirit is still under... Well, never mind that. Any, I don't understand that. But anyhow, people say to me, are you looking for the ultimate uh, laws of physics? No, I'm not. I'm just looking to find out more about the world. And if it turns out there is a simple ultimate law that explains everything, so be it. That would be very nice to discover. If it turns out it's like an onion with millions of layers and we're just sick and tired of looking at the layers, then that's the way it is. But whatever way it comes out, its nature is there and she's going to come out the way she is. My interest in science is to simply find out about the world. And the more I find out, I can't believe the special stories that have been made about our relationship to the universe at large because they seem to be too simple, too, too, too connected, too local, too provincial. The earth, he came to the earth. One of the aspects of God came to the earth, mind you. And look at what's out there. How can he, it isn't in proportion. Once you start doubting, which I think to me is a very fundamental part of my soul, is to doubt and to ask. I can live with doubt and uncertainty and not knowing. I think it's much more interesting to live not knowing than to have answers which might be wrong. I have approximate answers and possible beliefs and different degrees of certainty about different things. But I'm not absolutely sure of anything, and there are many things I don't know anything about, such as whether it means anything to ask why we're here and what the question might mean. I might think about it, but if I can't figure it out, then I go to something else. But I don't have to know an answer. I don't have. To, I don't feel frightened by not knowing things, by being lost in a mysterious universe without having any purpose, which is the way it really is, as far as I can tell. Possible. It doesn't frighten. Me.